Hi, let's step outside today and draw this little guy. We're gonna start with the envelope. I place the bottom and the top and it will fit inside a long rectangle. So it's from the hat to the shoes. Next, you want to cut the body in half. That will be about the, the beard, the beard and the shoulders. And next, It looks like um, a long teardrop. That's what I would do. That's what I imagine for the head and the hat. So you have the top of the hat, the beard, and the right side of the head. The body it looks like a fat teardrop. So always work with the big shapes first. That's why next comes the hat. So from the beard to the hat, it's about half, half. And here, from the beard to the hat, it's two thirds. That's how I find the slanted line for the hat. I will draw like an oval shape for the face. So there you have the hat, the face, and the beard. The body. The shirt is halfway between the shoes and the beard. So it's a curvy line. I will cut then the pen in half. I mean, not quite half. Beside being bigger, and then the shoes and the other side. So I'll take care of the hands later and the bottle later. I'm going back to the face and the hat. So it looks like the hat could be longer. Or maybe the face not so, so wide. So let's refine the face because that's the most important part here. I'm gonna place the eye line. It follows the hat, so it's about slanted, almost parallel to the, the line of the hat. I place the nose and the mouth. Like I said, it looks like the hat could be a tad higher. I think the proportions are right. And now I can refine the face. I 
You have the nose here. The nose is bigger. The crease here, the cheek, and the eyes. So I just draw them on the eye line as sketched before. The corner of the eye here lines up with the side of the nose. And there I have my face. I'll just draw a few lines to suggest the beard here. The beard starts from the cheek. And it goes down to where I sketched earlier. I trace a few lines. It goes to the ear. And now I can place the hat. I just refined the line I had before. It's in the right spot, so I know that it's all good. Let's draw the hat. So there are folds here, halfway between the top of the hat and the base of the hat. It's round. And then on the other side, it's curvy. There's a dent and it goes to the top. It's clean here on the side. Let's draw the eyes now. I can darken them. A few lines right there on the forehead for the hair. Now let's place the arms before the body. So the arms are inside this green shape. I'm going to draw an oval here for the hands. The right hand, the left hand, It's above the shirt here. This arm is outside of the green shape. And this is easy. You have two curvy lines from the wrist to the armpit, and from the wrist to the shoulder. Now the fingers are easy. Just imagine you're drawing, you're drawing three smiles. One, two, three smiles for the fingers. Now the, the bottle. The bottom is on the level of the groin here. And the top starts from the knuckles. So you have the slanted line, a straight vertical line, a slanted line, and 
another slanted line. And here from the groin to the fist, it's a slanted line. Let's erase inside the bottle. I might as well erase my envelope now. Now the lines of the bottle have to be parallel. The top goes down, the right side up, and the line in the middle, not quite vertical, crooked. So we'll do the same thing for the uh, left hand. A smile. Second and third. And you have here the thumb that sticks out. So the shirt starts above the bottle, below the hand, and it goes to the elbow. The legs, so the pen starts from the corner of the bottle, here it's a curvy line, I connect the groin to the pen, another curvy line here, so the side of the body is not rounded like I sketched earlier. Instead, it's concave, like so. The shoes are very easy. Almost like half a circle. And then from the pen, you curve it, you go up, and you connect to the pen on this side. Let's not forget the cork, the top of the bottle, right above the index finger. Let's finish with eyebrow and I think I'm done so if you like this video please leave a comment below and don't forget to subscribe so you get notified of my new tutorials sorry about that Let's clean a little bit. And I think I'm done. Thanks for watching and see you next time.